Tigers fan, we back with another video. Um, you already know. If you're first time checking out my channel, man, I'm your humble host, Jerome Smith. And on this channel, we do fragrance reviews, guys. So listen, we're back and we're going to be talking about Rue Bracca Intense. This guy right here. Now, I do believe Rue Bracca is off of the house of Armoff or F9. You guys correct me as I believe it's either Armoff or F9. But Rue Bracca Intense, man, I'm going to tell you what I think about it. Give you all my thoughts on it. All right. Stay tuned. The Fragrance Show. time out your day shouts out to everybody in the fragrance community salute to all my content creators man <clears throat> shouts out to all my new subscribers and return subscribers guys so rue Braca intense this one right here now i've been sitting on this one for some weeks now i do have this guy right here rue Braca pure home rue Braca pride pure home i did a video up on this one guys this one is up on the channel um really the same in presentation except the intense one the cap is gray sorry about that light or gray or silver and the regular pride one the cap the trimming around it is black but nevertheless pride intense guys um i did pick this bottle up off of ebay i'm going to link that seller down in the description this is 100 ml 3.4 ounce and i do believe it's going for probably like around 21 or $22. I think that's a great, great price for this fragrance. And I think, I think um, the Pride one, regular one, is like around 20. If you can get these for like 20, that is a good deal. Be wearing this fragrance uh, right now. Um, I've been meant to do this review, but I'm gonna spray it. Atomizer's not bad. I got a strip here with me. I'm gonna spray it on the strip. This fragrance, it's, it's kind of interesting um before i get into the note breakdown it's interesting because i thought before buying it i thought i was going to get more of the same as the first juice you know the first juice is kind of like a freshy blue style kind of fragrance so when i heard the rue Braca intense i'm like okay they just going to ramp up the one you know from the beginning and this is going to be a flanker or whatever the case might be but this fragrance is totally different guys this one um, and I tried to find some notes up on it. Maybe there is, but um, just off sheer smell, this is like a woody aromatic style kind of fragrance. All right, it starts out woody. This could be like, this could be like a cedar wood in this one, cedar wood. But then some sweetness starts to come through on this one, and I get like this vanilla sweetness. This vanilla shoes, but not too sweet. To me, this has a vanilla undertone and it could be like cedar wood um, in the top of this fragrance. But as this fragrance starts to work, wood stick around, then in the base, it gets like a creamy style. So it might be like sandalwood mixing with the vanilla, but it also gets like a little amber style too. Yeah, this is totally different than the first one for sure, guys. Honestly, don't even know what this is trying to clone. Some folks say it's cloning Paco Rabanne Pure SXS. I don't know that to be true. I have not smelled that fragrance, but just off this one. Now, I will say this does remind me of a fragrance from Al Hermain called Detour Rouge, and that one has a lot going on with it as well. But I actually like the vanilla in this one, woody style, aromatic, very masculine fragrance. Even though it has some sweetness coming through, it's definitely masculine. Um, yeah, it could be like cedar wood. Yeah, like I said, if you can get this for like $20, $21, I will say add it, but I will say that with this one this one doesn't have the same pop for its projection as the first one uh the notes in this one is not you know i guess it's they're not as volatile as the the first one so just be aware of that i think some folks if you wear this out you might have to overspray or folks might have to come into you know like an arms lift of you just to get you know a little waff of this it's not a skin scent but it's not popping right now and it's not it's not the biggest room filler either. To me, this is more so getting into that range of a personal scent. Seasons for this one though, guys, 
spring and fall to me this is more of a spring fall i would say nighttime kind of fragrance so you actually get the yin and yang if you got the if you got the rubaca pride pure omen you got this one because you can wear the pure own just for like errands and you know daytime affairs and stuff like that and then you could throw this one on at night if you're going out with a date night or you're going to be in like a lounge bunch of people you feel me in proximity i think people would you know get a nice whiff of you wearing this i said guys like a kind of woody aromatic cedar wood vanilla undertone with this one um but it's nice it's nice doesn't have to pop it's not popping off the strip like that and it's not even popping off my skin uh, but I could wear it as I, I could start to smell it as I start to move around and stuff like that. Still a nighttime fragrance. To me, this is definitely, I say you could dress this one up. You don't need a tie, but I definitely would put like a collar shirt on with this one with a sports coat for sure, guys. Now, performance on this one, overall performance. Longevity you're going to get on this one is like that five hour mark, five to six hour mark longevity. And I will say it does project okay definitely within like an orange length for like the first hour slightly above that and then it plays like personal you know it comes in very personal a little bit um i would say with this one doesn't pop like probably the this guy right here it doesn't have the kind of popping popping this with this one as far as projection but nevertheless a good fragrance for about 20 bucks you know, if you want to add it, I say definitely go ahead and add it. But you guys let me know down in the comments what you guys think about the intense version of the Rue Braca for sure. I might play with it a little bit more. I think, you know, just to have, you know, if you're going out at night and you need something just to throw on right quick, I say, hey, take a shot with it, guys. Rue Braca Pride Intense. All right. Thanks for watching another video with your boy, man. If you need more content, click on that video header up above. If you want to like and subscribe to the channel, you can go and do that as well. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Salute.